momentous day because this is the last time I'll be driving any of my children. Um, I'm going to pick up Ryan for his driver's test. Very excited for him because she's not feeling well. Praying to the porcelain god. Well, I have no idea where he is. Um, I texted him multiple times. I called him a bunch of times and um, I got nothing. So he's going to be late. Actually, he's not going to make his appointment. Oh, a series of unfortunate events. It was a series of unfortunate events. Okay, welcome to today's vlog, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, it's about 6.30, 6.40, I'm getting ready for school. And today's a big day because I'm getting my driver's license. I'm 17 and a half, so I should have it by now. And it's pretty embarrassing that I don't, but today's the day, finally. Uh, it's taken so long, partially because I moved from Maryland to Florida and the requirements are different. So when we switched our residency from Maryland to Florida, I couldn't get it while I was still living in Maryland. So when I got down here, I stalled and still, that was my fault. Like I waited a long time to get it. And in Florida, you have to wait a year from when you get your permit to when you get your license. Anyway, I got it last February and now I'm ready to finally get it. It's been horrible not having it because Florida you get it right when you're 16 which is one of the earliest of like any state so um all my friends have had it for years and it's annoying asking for rides or anything it's you know being a senior and not having a license it, it's horrible anyway it's finally about to be over if I pass gonna finish getting ready and uh I gotta make my hair look decent because I'm gonna be taking a pretty important picture that's gonna be on there for a couple years and I looked up the right shirt color to wear it said like blue, green, or pink, solid color. So I'm gonna try to pick out a shirt for the picture. Anyway, stay tuned. I'm gonna get picked up from school a little bit early to go take it because the last time I had was at like 2.15. So I'm gonna go take this test and uh, wish me luck. Okay, we're in the car on the way to school. I got my green shirt on. It's a big day. Yeah. Yeah. Um, Another day in which to excel, first of all. The uh, the place where we do it is pretty far from the school, so I'm, I think I'm gonna get to miss. That's your driver's test. Yeah. Momentous day because this is the last time I'll be driving any of my children to school. Yeah, I mean, and yeah, you might be happy about it, but come on. The lighted. <laughs> and the cats in the cradle and the stones. <laughs> Jeez, exactly. man. Uh, yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna get to miss a, a good part of the last half of the day, which I'm pretty excited about. What are you gonna miss? Miss English. Oh, I'll be fine. Um, and so, yeah, I there's a written test and a driving skills test, as always. So, you passed a written test. Yeah, I will pass the permit written test. I think I'd take another one. No. Oh, really? No. Oh, fantastic. I think I'm pretty sure it's just a, you've already passed that. All right, so. Those are the rules of the road, and then the driver's test is the... Yeah. Anyway, watch out. If you're in Florida, you might see me. You, you, might, you might see me whipping. <laughs> so, just be careful very slowly. <laughs> um, I'm going to pick up Ryan for his driver's test. Very excited for him, and uh, Jill was very much looking forward to taking him. And um, we went out and had some dinner last night. I think she got a little bit of food poisoning because she is not feeling well. And um, she's been sick all morning and she feels bad, but she just could not get out of bed. Um, at the Donnelly house, we call throwing up, um, uh, we call it praying to the porcelain God, or we call it talking to Johnny on the big white phone. Um, and, uh, or we call it blowing chunks, blowing lunch, all that kind of, that kind of thing. But, uh, She's doing that and she's feeling a little bit better, but not, not good enough to take Ryan. So I am doing that and I'm excited. So kind of write a passage that uh, we'll always remember. So fingers crossed that we have, we, 
went through all the stuff last night. I think we're in pretty good shape. So now we just need to be in, in time for the appointment, which is about a half hour away from here. So come on along. I'm going to pick him up from school right now. He's going to bug out early and uh, we'll see how he does. Okay, uh, waiting outside of school now and um, it takes about a half hour to get there and he's still not out. So I've texted him, I've called him, he's still not out here. So I would hate for him to miss his appointment, but it looks like he's gonna miss his appointment because we can't speed there. And um, I don't know why he has not responded. Maybe he's in class and he can't use his phone or something like that, but um, I told him I'd come pick him up. Actually, his mom was supposed to pick him up. I wonder if he's waiting for a call from her. I don't know, but uh, it's getting down to it. Hope he makes it. Well, I have no idea where he is. Um, I texted him multiple times. I called him a bunch of times and um, I got nothing. So he's gonna be late. Actually, he's not gonna make his appointment. So I'm sad for him, but I just can't understand. We said, just leave school a little after one and uh, he's just, uh, I don't know, maybe he ran into a teacher issue or whatever, but he's not taking his test today. Too bad. Get your license? Nah. What happened? Oh, a God. series of unfortunate events. It was a series of unfortunate events. You want to come forward? I'm sorry. I know you guys <laughs> really wanted to see me get it today, but it's going to have to wait another week. Um, basically, I was supposed to get taken out of school uh, to go to the appointment, but I walked out of fifth period with my phone in my hand, and my school does not take lightly to that. And I got caught. So I had to go turn my phone in. And the detention, what do they call it? The detention office? The discipline office. Discipline office. And so I said, how will I know when to leave? Because I have to leave soon. And they said, oh, we'll call you. I said, All right. So I put my phone up and I went through sixth period, which when I was supposed to leave was in was the sixth period. And they didn't call me. So I went back to the office and I said, I think I need to leave. They said, you think you need? So they called the office. And they were like, we don't have anything for Ryan Donnelly. From like his parents, right? So I was supposed to take Ryan, but I was deathly ill in bed. And then Mike pinched hit, pinched hit, it, pinched, pinch hit, pinched pinch hit, hit yeah. pinch hit for me. And last night we were talking about how, hey, it's so crazy. You can just walk out of school here. Like you don't need to have all these things. I think dad misunderstood. I think yeah, it's easier Mike to get Ryan out didn't have than his in phone. Maryland, but I like that's not how they do it. You don't just text your student and walk out. Like, right. So dad so anyway. never said anything to the office, so they didn't know I was supposed to leave. Anyway, like two o'clock came around and I was like, I'm gonna miss this. So I went to the thing and then they, I called mom a few times, she didn't pick up, but then- I was sleeping, I yeah. didn't know. Well, I had to call her from the school right. phone because they didn't give me my phone back. Ugh, and um, mess. it was just a complete mess. So we drove all the way there still, but they don't, let you like you if can't you, be if you oh my gosh if you sign in a minute late it'll say oh you missed your appointment so we we're 30 minutes late so the lady said you have to reschedule so i was very disappointed and i just came home now one more what's one more week now it's one more week i gotta it. change some plans <laughs> that I thought you thought you're gonna be driving some places but it's fine because number one I'm not going to any Orioles. I don't. I wasn't scheduled to go to any Good. Orioles spring training games uh, until after next week. Or, or until next week. Um, and there's some good news right here. Ryan's seen your pictures. Yeah, I've seen your pictures. I oh, hope they're good. Do not send. I'm sure but, they're um, be beautiful. And tell everybody why, like, what where you're excited about your senior picture going. Oh yeah, so my nana, who is right over there, has a wall of a bunch of pictures with our family and everyone growing up and everything, but she has a certain section for all of our senior pictures. So all my older cousins, Will, Ben, Nick, Tommy, Carly, um, Katie, Brendan, Sash, they all have their senior pictures up there. And so mine will finally go up. And looks it, it looks good. good. Here's your boy. Come there on. There he is. Do you look similar? Uh-huh, you do. Um, you look like him. Wow, they, I think they did some editing on this. Well, they, they do a little brush up stuff. They definitely brushed up. Yes. Because my skin looks fantastic. Well, it and looks it, fantastic now, too. Thank you. using the hazel, I was a hazelnut, switch <laughs> hazel. This is, these are wallets for your friends, and this is for me, me and dad. We get to hang this up in our house. Aww. So we have the 8x10, you have
have those for Nani and Nana. Perfect. And then these are for your friends. Nice. Excellent. All right, so all's not lost. We had a good day today. Well, I didn't. You had The hair looks good, though. It does. You got some rocking I mean, hair. I mean, that is like popping. total popping. You're wow. so handsome. I can't believe you're a senior. Interesting day today. Yes, interesting day. Um, In the end, everything worked out, right? We're going to thug it out. We're going to thug it out. Um, I got to go to bed, you guys. I'm still sick as a jaybird. So, are Jay Bird sick? I don't, I don't know. I'm not, right, I can hardly talk. I gotta go to bed really quick. Yeah. So, um, you're gonna be leaving tomorrow. I leave tomorrow to go to work. Yeah, you leave if you're like this. Um, I'm hoping I'm gonna be better tomorrow. That's good. So, my flight's in that after, like, you'll come out from school, I'll see you, and then I'll fly. Okay, sounds good. And then, okay. um, so, Dad, can you take me to school tomorrow? What? That was not my plan. I know, it wasn't mine either. <laughs> here we are. Um, and here we are. So sometimes things work out. Sometimes as you life's gonna sometimes get you down and you, you just need to thug it pull out. yourself up by your bootstraps and keep on going. All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching. What made me happy today was Ryan Senior Pictures. Mm -hmm. What made you happy today? Um absolutely nothing. <laughs> Dad just said absolutely nothing. Yeah. Nothing today. Something, you guys. Every day no, is, a, is a blessing. School, school wasn't bad. Okay. Oh, you got your t-shirt back. Oh, that's right. I got my t-shirt back. Katie stole that for a very long time. And when this I was is a whole this weekend, different story. Yeah, we'll tell that later. We'll tell it one time. You guys, thank you so much back. for watching. She's back. This, you guys. Is that what made you happy? My extra, extra, extra large shirt is back. Yeah. That's what made me happy today. All right, you guys, comment what made you guys happy today, and we will see you tomorrow. Stay tuned to see if Ryan actually does end up getting his driver's license before he graduates from high school. Hopefully. <laughs>